What's up Tricos and people, my name is Relic Septile, coming at you with a new top 5. Last top 5, I actually put you with a vote between top 5 Hoenn Pokemon or top 5 Sinnoh Pokemon, and top 5 Hoenn Pokemon has actually won. But today, I've actually decided, since the announcement or introduction of Pokemon Omega Ruby and Alpha Sapphire have been announced, I have decided to make my personal own top 5 home Pokemon that need Mega Evolutions or any kind of new form that they might introduce in the games. But today I'm going to be doing Mega Evolutions. I'm going to do, I will be doing my top 5 favorite home Pokemon later. But for this top 5, I've decided to do this just because I can. So we're going to be starting with this top 5. But before we do that, I just want to remind you all that this is 100% my opinion. Which means if you disagree with me, be sure to leave your top 5 in the comment section below. Uh, you might leave top fives, top threes, or maybe your favorite. I don't really care. As long as you just have your own opinion or agree with mine, that is basically awesome. So let's get in with the top five. In the number five spot, we have Swellow. Why do you think Swellow is one of the most burp Pokemon that is deserving a mega evolution? Since... All the bird Pokemon that have been announced earlier in the games, for example, Pidov, Starly, Pidgey, all of these have the common thing that they all have three, like, evolution lines, except for Taylor. Taylor only has one mega, one evolution line, which is Swellow. Swellow is actually frailing in defense, but it, I think it has pretty good attack and speed. That's why if it gets a mega evolution, they would actually maybe give it a possible ability, that's what you're going you're gonna to be seeing on the top 5 layout, you're going to be seeing a possible ability, Gale Wings. Giving, giving Swallow Gale Wings is actually going to be giving him a chance to actually show up his, his attack. If the Mega Evolution like thing increase, increases his attack and speed, it might be unstoppable. Because since Down Flame is actually um, a Pokemon that can get Gale Wings as, as it's said in ability, Giving Swallow Gale Wings also would give it a pretty good chance of proving itself in battle and not as this frail bird that you can one shot. So yeah, that's why Swallow is number 5 in the top 5 home Pokemon that deserve a Mega Evolution. In the number 4 spot, we have Sharpedo. Yes, Sharpedo the Water and Dark type Pokemon. It is the brutal Pokemon. And the reason I want this to have a Mega Evolution is because same with Swallow, it is very frail. It cannot take a hit. And... Since it is a water drop type, it's pretty a pretty unique type, but giving it speed boost as a possible ability, not as a hidden ability, would actually help it a lot. That since it can like be an attacker, it is a good attacker with increased speed, it would actually cover up its frail defenses. So pretty much torpedo can cover itself maybe deal a hit before it can die in one hit or whatever. So yeah, that is why Sharpedo, I think, is most deserving of a Mega Evolution. In the number three spot, we have Milotic. So, I think pretty much, I don't see Milotic being given the love that it deserved. Since it, been, it, it was left out by many people, it is used a little bit in competitive battling, but I think if it gets a Mega Evolution, it can actually like step up its game since I think it's very very bulky compared to any Pokemon so with that bulk if it can deal a lot of hits it will be unstoppable if it can be a little bit more faster that is also gonna help it out and I don't really see a possible ability for this thing since it can get competitive Marvel scale or leaving huge charm this thing any possible ability that would actually help it would be actually pretty good pretty good on it it would make it a god i don't know because I, I used my lodic once in a randomizer that i've been playing and it was pretty pretty much um it was putting up my expectations the only thing that is very slow or at least mine was so yeah if it can get a pretty much speed boost that was gonna be pretty amazing in the number two spot we have metagross metagross is the iron leg pokemon and I have used it a couple of times in competitive battling. I know it's a steel type which makes it slow, but it has the ability of light metal and clear body. This thing, I could not predict a possible ability for it like the other Pokemon, but as you can see, the design of its mega, of a, like a fake 
Mega Evolution, is, it was a fan-made Mega Evolution. It, re, it looks pretty amazing. Other than its design and its, its, its decent stats, it is pretty bulky because it's a steel type. And special attack is okay for, for a psychic type. It can deal a hit, but giving it kind of being a mixed attacker as a Mega Evolution, that will make it unstoppable. Maybe if it can, if with light metal, I don't think, I think an ability which makes it pretty much faster, that would pretty much make it pretty unstoppable since it can be a mixed attacker as a Mega Evolution. That's what pretty much what I want to expect on this Metagross. Because Metagross has a lot of potential in it, and since it's build, build him doesn't get takedown until like you can like train it up a lot until it get it gets rid of takedown. It makes it pretty much useless at the beginning. So giving it a Mega Evolution would actually give potential and give other people a chance to actually train up a build to actually use a Mega Metagross. I know that most of you guys have actually been seeing seeing this coming, but in the number one spot we have Swampert and Sceptile. A tie between these two. Since 6th gen, they have announced um, a Mega Blaziken that you can get via trade. It seems pretty unfair for the other two 3rd gen stores not to get a Mega Evolution. And if Nintendo doesn't give them a Mega Evolution, then they're pretty much stupid. Why give Blaziken all the love? I know that it must be a fan favorite, but why leave the other two out? Sceptile, of course it's my mascot, but I see it's, it could be a really good Pokemon as a Mega and it has a lot of potential in it. Same with Swampert. No hit on, not, no hit on Blaziken. But leaving these two out is a pretty much big mistake. Um, it, you know all guys that Sceptile is a mixed attacker. So giving it the ability Protein. Which as a hidden. No not a hidden ability. As a possible ability as a Mega Evolution. Would actually help it a lot, out a lot. Same with it being given overgrown and unburned. I don't think unburned actually helps it a lot, but giving it protein as a mega evolution, it will wreck houses. And I am not even kidding. Moving on to Swampert, it is the Mudfish Pokemon. It gets torrent and damp as it's damp as its hidden ability. So Swampert also is pretty much a good special attack. It is pretty bulky. If it gets Sap Sipper, it is gonna be a monster. It's gonna be a god because it is weak to grass. It's it's like four times weak because it's like water and ground. So giving it sad sipper is gonna be pretty much amazing, and it will probably make it unstop unstoppable. It will take down a lot of Pokemon and it will wreck houses. And then Blaziken is pretty much gonna be useless because these two are gonna be the monsters of the new gen or whatever. But yeah, these two Pokemon are pretty much amazing. Have a lot of potential into them, and they were gonna be. Pretty much awesome mega evolutions if you can get them early on in the game. And I'm pretty sure I'm going to be using Sceptile anyway. So fuck that shit. Thank you guys so much for checking out my top 5 mega evolutions in Hoenn that deserve a mega evolution. If that made any sense. So yeah. Um, if you have enjoyed, please leave a rating, a like, and comment with your own top 5 Hoenn Pokemon that need a mega evolution. Next top 5, we're going to be seeing my personal top 5 favorite Hoenn Pokemon because that was what was supposed to be done but I decided to do this because it's awesome and yeah guys uh be pretty sure I'm hyped for Pokemon Omega Ruby and Alpha Sapphire I'm pretty sure you are too so yeah guys I'll be seeing you in the next top five peace